For five seconds on July 12th, flames lit up the night sky on Edwards Lumen Ridge. That's when the Air Force Research Laboratory's Propulsion Directorate, Detachment 7, conducted part of a new phase of upper stage engine technology program testing. The current phase of the program involves testing a turbo pump, the component that essentially drives a liquid rocket engine. USET is primarily focused on the next generation of design tools. We have developed a set of design tools for the uh, engine system, combustion chamber, and turbo pump. And with that, the next generation of designers will be able to design a new rocket engine and it will take them less time, higher fidelity, and lower cost. Back when they designed the current engine that was done in the 60s, it was a test-driven development. It took 700 tests in order for the engine to be brought to flight. And, you know, that's a tremendous amount of cost. Today, we're looking at using more computer simulation and computer modeling with physics-based tools so that we can actually look at all the, the bad designs on the computer, try them all out, and then only come to the test stand with a finished final design for qualification testing. And, and then certify the reliability of the successful design. Along with releasing hydrogen exhaust in the form of flames from flare stacks, an enormous amount of data was obtained as a result of the USET program's testing. Uh, this is the second uh, in a series of the exact same test just to prove uh, pre precision and that we get the same result uh, every time, and they were very successful. The, the pump performed exactly as the model predicted, and it performed exactly as it did last time. So we feel comfortable going into the sustained duration tests that we've uh, got the, the modeling and sim that we need, we've got the instrumentation down, and we're prepared to, to collect that extended uh, time data. Operating at 90,000 rotations per minute, this particular turbo pump ran at three times the speed of other upper stage engine pumps, propelling the turbo pump into its next phase of testing, called the mapping phase. We just uh, completed our characterization testing, basically doing small bumps um, up to 100% speed, and now we're in the turbo, map, uh, turbo pump mapping phase. And uh, this is part of the program where we're validating um, our tools that were used to design this uh, turbo pump. So we're, we want to see, um, do our computer models, when we predict a test, do they actually compare to what reality is? That way we can validate it and say the physics in the models are functioning correctly and uh, therefore can be used successfully for future programs. The next phase of USET testing will involve the combustion chamber. Jet Fibera, Edwards Air Force Base, California. This has been Dateline Edwards. If you have questions or comments, we'd like to hear from you. Please send us an email at channel.6 at edwards.af.mil.